I don't know if you knew this about Al Capone, but he was the first to do a couple of things. Number one, he was the first person on the FBI's most wanted list. He was number one. He was the first person ever listed on the FBI's most wanted list. I didn't know that. Number two, he was the first person went over on the first boatload to Alcatraz, the prison, when the feds took it over. He was the first guy there. He spent five years in Alcatraz. And some of the things that happened to him in Alcatraz, I mean, he was bullied in there. He was already suffering from syphilis. His mind was going on him a little bit. And he was actually bullied in there uh, by some of the inmates. And that's something that I had heard before, but you know, this kind of confirmed it. And then he was also one of the first patients, I should say, to receive penicillin in 1945. I think many of you know this, that Al Capone suffered from neurosyphilis. And it's something he contracted at an early age. Unfortunately, he was a guy that enjoyed brothels, enjoyed prostitutes. He hung out a lot.